No, no, no. <clears throat> It was my life. Last things setting up, minus one. That's nice. That should do it. Kan, totdat hij de lobby gevonden heeft. Het zal niet altijd lang duren, denk ik. Ja. I'll try to keep it in English. So yeah, that is a, it is a strange uh, little competition this time. It's only five people. <laughs> Accidentally, the whole uh, Smash committee together with Nudi, Forkman. But we'll make the best of it. It gives us the opportunity to put more streams on, uh, or put more matches on stream actually. So yeah, first time on stream, uh, at least as ever stream since a while. I was planning to do it on the stream week. But unfortunately I got Corona. Nothing you could do about it. But I'm doing better already, so. Ah, there's up boy. I don't expect anything else but DDD versus Yoshi. I mean, what else? These two are clearly veteran players in their fighter. And of course, the more defensive playstyle of, of Akam doesn't do him very much favors against the more projectile based gameplay of a DDD. Well, my money would be on the DDD this game, but you never know. One good spike from a Yoshi could end it all. I would love to see a, in a primarily aerial based fight with Yoshi's great double jump and of course DDD's five jumps. And stage wise, I'm not so sure. I think they both prefer the more flat stages. I know uh, Devoid isn't a fan of the tri, tri platforms at all, so Battlefield and Yoshi's are not stages I think we will see. And both of them hate uh, Lilith. Not as much as me, but still decent. Okay, looks like they are selecting a stage now. And the chat's still a bit empty, but uh, if you could tell me if everything sounds okay. Nothing. Uh, do, I, do I sound too hard? Does the game sound too uh, quiet? Give it to me. 
just before we start the first game. This is, by the way, one of the only sets I will be solo casting, because I got the number one seed, so I get the free buy. If you do exclamation mark bracket, you can see it. Oh, suddenly it's busy in here. But I think they got their stage right. They got their fighters. Ready? Here we go. Which stage will they bring us to? I would think a PS2 or a small battlefield. Ah, thank you, thank you. Three, two, it's PS2 indeed. One, so no, no real advantages on this stage. Both of the characters can do well. See a little bit of damage wrecking. Misses the tech in the DDD. And tanks a huge dash attack. Both players are <laughs> aiming for the big moves. It's a lot of damage, it's just not very safe. But if they're both whacking each other around for 15 to 20 percent of the time, this would be a quick match. Gets the grab into up air, that's a true combo. Does DI quite poorly there, could have been killed. And there goes the double jump of the Yoshi, which the DDD does not capitalize on. Tries to look for the up air or up tilt and gets it for the kill. Fast and strong move, one of the only ones DDD has though. And now I would advise the DDD just to rack up some easy damage points. Don't go for any big moves, just throw out the up tilts, the down tilts. And you can really take this lead to the whole new level. Yeah, so he is looking for the landing Nair into up tilts, but they are not just connecting because Yoshi, despite having an average model, can still pancake when he's landing with fair or something. Yeah. Ooh, reads for the backer and tanks a huge forward smash. Luckily it was a cross stage, otherwise it would be a dead Yoshi and a two stock lead for the DD. Yeah, and there we see one of DDD's biggest perks. He is one of the most heavy characters, but also the only heavy fast faller. So killing him off the top of the screen is incredibly hard. And much you have much more success if you try to kill him from the sides. Yeah, the, the small hits from the Yoshi are just not doing it right now. Takes another up air. You cannot really afford those right now. And that would be the second stock. 215% on the DVD. This is not what you want to see for the first. Yeah, gets the up air finally for the kill. Took a while, but uh, nothing's lost. Huge down air. 24% from one move. Nice. If Yoshi can get a pretty decent combo, he can easily rack up to 70% on the DDD, but uh, we have to wait. Still hasn't been hit this stock. Oh, there's the first hit. Gets out of the second follow-up with the Nair. Shields the dash attack this time. Very nice. And then runs in with the dash attack of his own into the giant jet hammer. Yeah, those smash attacks aren't doing you much uh, good right now. <laughs> but to be fair, I think he, he will need to finish this stuff decently early. And he does. It can go both ways now. And of course, the DD does have a lot of wiggle room here. But I wouldn't count Yoshi out just yet. If he... Okay, <laughs> he just needs to, to take his approaches from the air a little bit more precise. Yoshi's love to drift in and go for the mix-ups or the cross-ups, but uh, sometimes you miss space and you tank a uh, forward smash from DDP. So yeah, game one goes to Devoid. Scores a bit. Just like that. 
Yeah, once you're stuck in PS2, shutting down the arena, what? I hope it's a meme, because I'm, I'm not feeling moving right now. Come on, tell me. Are we, are we shutting down, or... Are we good? There wasn't any lag that I could see, or any problems, so... I don't know. But uh, I can now take the time uh, with you guys to quickly look over... Oh, never mind. Okay, so this does mean that they're staying on PS2. Which makes it easier for us. Yeah, for them. Yeah, the stage didn't add much to the victory of DDD. It was just more the, the misspacing and the, the second stop, which took far too long. On the first stop, actually. Okay, again... Immediately on the offensive, both players running off the starting platforms and those uh, upper bridges or upper combos, all the Yoshis are looking for and just couldn't get last game. But now starting off with a decent uh, 96%. Does the eye correct this time from the up air? Yes, he the the. The jump into back air, it just doesn't work out this game. So, if I were Yoshi, I would just stop with those and try to, to get a more grounded approach. Nice stall for the up air. Gets quickly down to the floor and down B. Nothing too crazy here. Yeah, save Nair and just go for the tech chases, go for the save damage. Yeah, and don't try to knock back a Gordo with back air. So I think up air or up tilt from DDD would kill at this percentage. But now we see the opposite. Now space, the, the DDD space is a little bit poorly and takes a huge forward smash. But takes the kill afterwards with a nice death stack. Gets the... Eh, not really tech chase, but just a, a nice follow up. And now the Yoshi is looking to keep this DDD nice at the ledge. Does lose him here and gets him back to center stage. But he does get him into the up airs in 71%. And now the revenge of the DDD gets him to 40. I would say with these percentages... Okay, now the Yoshi is in the lead. Otherwise I would have said it's, it's, it's even. It's even. But yeah, the Yoshi does seem to have uh, cleaned his game up a little bit. But then uh, the DDD does not go over ledge. Needs to go beyond it. Cancels his jump pretty early. And then, the, yeah, it's just easy to follow his trajectory. And thanks to up smash. I have not seen the... DVD or the Yoshi go off stage here for a follow up spike or something. We might see it if the if there comes a game three or if the if the Yoshi gets a stock lead, he might get the confidence to do so. But uh, it is of course risky. Both of them have good counter edge guard tools or how do you want to know, off stage tools. Just misses the suck. And also, luckily, gets the back end of the up air or up smash. And again, we see the problem that, that they cannot really finish the stop. Ooh, okay. Return Gordo into a bad DI, I believe. Is enough to take the game. Mm hmm. Yeah, I, it appears we have a bot in the chat. Thank you. Okay, and that goes the second game. Or the first set actually goes to a game three. Very nice. Now, of course, the DDD gets to pick the counter stage. I'm wondering if he wants to, to take it to a bigger stage. To run away more from the up airs. 
get a higher ceiling maybe because the times he did die he gets knocked in the top yeah top blast uh, zone but yeah ddd doesn't really have a go-to stage i believe it's just more like get out of combos with more wiggle room and more off-stage abilities And the smaller side blast zones are also not ideal, but does he does have a way to die early. And quickly looking at the other set going on between Daniel Bananio and Vorkman, it's also 1-1. One, one. And I know from experience that it's a, it's a hard matchup for Dan, because it's the, the Bowser Falco matchup. And Bowser's just combo food. We will be going to a different stage. I am expecting something like Kalos or maybe Town and City. But we'll see. We are going to... He beats uh, Kalos. Yes. That is indeed what I did expect. Nothing too crazy here. Just some safe damage with the forward tilt, so that is mostly all of that you have to do against the Yoshi. And of course, shield is your biggest friend against the Yoshi players, but. I know Devoid's habits are not to shield as much as other players. That's okay. But does take a huge stock here. At like 90% against the DDD. That's not what you want. Could not capitalize on rage whatsoever. Hmm, he takes the return Gordo to the face for an easy 30%. Closes it out with a backer though. Still did 55% to him, so it's not, not terrible, but he does have to watch out a bit. So, uh, it's, it's starting to rack up now. And, uh, looking exactly at the moves that you don't want to take from the Yoshi, but down airs can do up to. How is an egg stronger than a DD spike ball? Yeah, the the the, the, pro, uh, the programmers thought it was fun to, to be able to send Gordas back at any point in time. But the egg is a really nice projectile though. And I think Capcom could be using it a little bit more to keep out targets like the DDD. But this is more the playstyle we would expect, so the heavy living to 160s, 150s. Ooh, and I come still a bit greedy for the down airs, which won't do much. Honestly, at this point, I would rather just avoid the, the down airs. The only thing they will do for you is uh, getting shielded and then acted out of, so you'll, you'll just die. Like that. Taking a huge jet hammer to the face at 140, yeah, that, that will kill. And now it's back in the lead for Devoid. If you can bring this to like 40%, I would say great job. Take that last stock, stock slowly. And do not greet for the big uh, final or final smashes, for the big forward smashes. Does get a uh, nice Gordo up throw there, but then loses the stock at 33%, which is immediately cancelled out by a comes uh, down air up tilt. And it's dead even. This is the down air for a trade. Okay, so now it's getting... Yeah, it's, it's getting pretty close. I would still say that the DD is in a little bit more comfortable position. Because of course he does take a lot more to be killed. But one good hit. Oh, and that should be it. Another jet hammer kill to finish the set. Very nice. That's winners first for you guys.
So congrats to uh, Devoid for closing that one out. In a 2-1 victory. Okay, very nice, very nice. I hope they all... Ooh, and actually... Um, Daniel Bananio gets knocked down to losers by Vorkman. So it's 2-1 for the Falco. It's uh, interesting. And I believe I have to play now. Why is the, the, the check-in timer so low? Oh. I will be joining them, so uh, one minute. Hello. Hello. Hey. Nice job so, on, the, on the victory. It's an exciting first game, I hope. <laughs> yeah, first game, uh, first set to game three is always nice. <laughs> but now... It was a close one. Yeah. It was very close. Closer uh, than I would have liked. Have you always <laughs> checked in for the match? Uh, oh, right. Um, it's going a little bit faster, so I'm looking at maybe slowing the bracket down a bit that you don't have to forcibly check in. Or just check in and wait wait the match, okay? Yeah, okay. Quick. Because now Dan and Akam should be able to uh, check in their match. Um, not yet. For me. Oh, I can check in, yeah. Yeah, so just check in, but don't do anything yet. You can just wait then. But uh, kind of an upset here. So C3, or Forkman takes C2. Done. He lost. Yeah, indeed. I did not really expect that. But didn't it... No, wait. Last time... What happened last time again? Um, last time he got sent to losers. By oh, wait. Last time you sent Forkman to losers. Yeah, and later on down where they first met in the tournament in losers finals. Um, yeah, so Dan would have won. Mm -hmm. And so which one uh, are you gonna cast first? The which one should we cast first? Your matches now or the match of Dan? And me? Um, let's see. If I do this one now, then we have to wait a bit. So I would say your match first. Uh, all right. And then I will just cast with uh, Michelle, I think. All right. Yeah. It's so a bit more case. makeshift this tournament, so bear with us, but uh, <laughs> we're having fun, so I hope you uh, have as well with watching. Not party people. And all the contenders are here. Yay. <laughs> so I've reset. And not all? Oh, yeah, all awesome. yeah. Don't know if you picked up what we said, but we want to stream losers uh, round one first. Losers round off first, all right, uh, then... So we can already kick someone out. <laughs> yeah, for fine by me. Um, <laughs> then I need to... Who do I need to join? Or do you join me or what up? You can join uh, uh, so, uh, Michelle's room. Michelle's, Michelle's. move to the casters. Yeah. It's your oh. typical password, you know it. <laughs> uh, I, I know I, it, yeah. Good luck. The best password. Good luck, guys. You. Imagine getting three games to scout your next enemy. I get all of the games to scout my enemies. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. Uh, I, was, I imagine having that privilege. I was um, quite happy with predicting uh, the, the stage choice when you uh, got to pick the last game. I did predict the Kalos. Yeah, of course, because you can't kill me from the top. I oh, wasn't going to get another it, strange Gordo it hit was, again. Uh, it was getting quite scary when you took that, that first stock very early, man. It was like 90% forward smash at the side and it was done. I thought uh, yep. it's very tough to come back from, but you did it. Nice job. Of course, of course. I just had to um, abuse the fact that he likes to uh, double jump past the ledge. Yeah, I... And of I course, you counter that with uh, super armor. I saw that as well, yeah. I might have... 
take you down a little bit or turn myself up a bit. I don't know. I see the le I only get to see the levels to as a reference, the audio levels, but I don't actually hear us. So, chat, uh, are we sounding a little bit the same volume or is one a lot louder? Talk to me. Yeah, Yoshi Bowser. In in his in in past matches, it is pretty Bowser favored, at least with his effort. So. Yes. That's a very good point. Uh, with. I would expect something neutral, or if. Uh, Akam does not know the matchup very well. He will let some try platform stages through. With I would imagine uh, Battlefield goes through before Yoshi's, because then it's just done if you're bouncing in Yoshi's. But um, I think PS2 or Battlefield might be contesters here. Okay, Michelle is now. Okay, so I have to crank you up again. <laughs> yes. Okay, I did so. I hope it's a little bit better now. I hope it's well. Otherwise, you can't hear me. That'd be a shame. Oh, it is and battlefield. We got a battlefield. Not my first choice to take a Bowser too, but of course he gets some bends as well. Oh, that's an unfortunate air dodge. But luckily, he survives. It's a Yoshi after all. Yeah, I saw a lot of cross-ups, uh, just not hitting the mark on you, and then he lands before you, and then it's, it's and yeah, it's done deal. <laughs> oh, it does disrespect the Bowser a little bit too much with those jabs, and thanks to the command grab. But still nothing to, to lose the game on. You also can't really hit the axe at the moment. Bit of a shame. Yeah, I saw um, just the lack of it in your matchup. I expected far more axe. Such an Me annoying. as well, but I'm happy they didn't yeah. survive. <laughs> it's such an annoying keep out too. Oh, oh, is he going to... Oh, nice, nice that reaction. Was an up smash? Yeah, yeah. Like that. <laughs> yeah, it would have killed. It would have killed, definitely. Okay, that killed. Don't underestimate the power of Yoshi's butt. Yeah, the down air, down, down bees through the platforms are nice, but takes the stock immediately back for a quick reset. So nothing to worry about. Yeah, Yoshi's getting a slight advantage here, but then again, Bowser can kill so early. Yeah, I would say you need it's like about a, even. Yeah, you need about a 40% lead to call it an advantage against Bowser. Oh. And he's already losing that. Yes. Yoshi doesn't ha really have any tools against the uh, flame breath. No. Except for evading it. But now Akam does kinda... Oh no, sorry. Dan does kinda disrespect the downbees. He does not care at all if they go through the platform and just tanks them. Which I think is not the smartest move, but uh, we'll see. It's uh, almost getting him already, so definitely not a smart choice. Just like an air dodge. Yeah, the, the up smash is surprisingly tall. Hits a lot above the uh, platforms. Yeah, I would have expected it a bit less, and also a bit less powerful. Then again, it's Yoshi, so... Yeah, he is surprisingly heavy. And I think this will be all top platform. Yeah, that definitely does it. That's why you don't want to take a Bowser to Battlefield. <laughs> nope. But he did He did hold out with it, and if you, you manage to get... grabbed at 140 at any stage, you'll probably die by Bowser, so it's not that big of a deal. Uh, Carlos uh, could it, disagree. It, it might, yeah. It might. Oh, oh. <laughs> Will we see the famous SDs? <laughs> <laughs> Haven't seen SD one yet. Haven't seen one yet. Of course, that is uh, the biggest fear of any tournament player in uh, these tournaments. Getting an SD and uh, getting put in the SD compilation. Yeah, but I think uh, Dan finally got his footing a bit more in this game. He does seem to take it a little bit more slow now without trading for unnecessary hits. He's just waiting for Yoshi to act and then uh, counter okay. him. And then he went for it. Yeah, huge up air in, uh, above the, the, the top platform to take game one. 
But uh, it was more close than I thought. Yeah, I would have expected uh, more. Uh, I would have expected Dan to kill earlier. Then again, anything can uh, change uh, during these ranking tournaments, of course. True. Do you think the Yoshi will stay on Battlefield? It did go decently it. for him, though. It went decent, but I don't think he'll um, choose it again. I think he might want to, um, I don't know, find a say that is a bit more cheesy. Yeah. Maybe take home ground. Yoshi story. Yoshi. Of oh. course, very dangerous, but maybe the ledges. Maybe he likes ledges. I would personally, uh, I would personally try to go to a stage where his where Bowser's LB can get stuck, like PS2 or maybe even that's a good one. Smashville or something. Smashville, of course, with the also the low uh, blast zones or the high lower blast zones. Should I say for the easy spikes? The maybe spike right there. Yeah. yeah. But then, of course, everything has a counterpart because some of those stages, the Bowser just kills you far too early. Like Town and City. Yeah, we did see at the end of the game that Dan got his confirms a little bit better and the side piece more consistent. So I think he got the shielding patterns of Akam a bit more down now. So I think this might be a lot quicker game. I think so. But we'll see if they uh, pick the stage. Oh, he went for the game rule. We see a swap. Okay, <laughs> interesting. So it might be a stage which he wasn't comfortable uh, comfortable with with the Bowser. Mm. Yeah, no. it's the mm. Stadium. Yeah. Of course, K. Rool has less of a problem with this uh, stage with recovering. Yeah. Although he almost would have SD'd there. Haha, <laughs> it's King K. Rool. It's fine. He always comes back. Uh, yeah, of course, King K. Rool doesn't mind a slow game. And uh, that's most of the time what Akam's, Akam is looking for as well. Yeah, Just... but I think K. Rool has the advantage in a slow game because he can just stand back, throw his projectiles, and for some reason you always get hit. Yeah, and the problem stays the same. You're still a heavy against Yoshi. Who has the decent uh, combo game with the uppers. Yeah, but he does have his uh, belly armor. True. Which will probably not really break on the Yoshi's attacks. Yeah, but the disadvantage is rough Ooh. with the platforms. That yeah, seems... that's a dangerous one. Yoshi's uh, force smash goes back a bit. So he can't really hit him that well. Yeah, I would like to see some more distance keeping from, from the King K. Rool here. He goes in a little bit too much. Yeah, maybe just throw his crown a bit, you know, for the super armor definitely. Yeah, and tone it down with the dash attacks, okay? <laughs> <laughs> they leave you we quite open. the armor, but it's not really going to help. It's a Yoshi. Yeah, so the best scenario probably would be you hit it on his uh, shield. And what then you take yeah. him there. Yeah, I don't know. He, he might be uh, thinking the wrong ways here. I mean, maybe his better offensive uh, against Yoshi I think than he defensive. still has uh, the Bowser mindset here. That's also uh, quite possible. Oh, nice, nice. That's trying to confirm into the up tilt. Ooh, both on the spike, neither of them got it. <laughs> I was a little bit more afraid for the King K. Rool at this percentage, though. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't go just forward smashing on Yoshi's jab. It's pretty fast. Knocks the ball out of the air, but then gets sucked up. That's the classic K rule. Well, the real classic is get hit by a crown, get hit by the cannonball, and get hit by a second cannonball. <laughs> but again, I, th I would say both players are uh, at kill percentage. Yeah, and uh, Dan's already adapting really well. That's, yeah, that's true. He loses his crown, though. Ah, he's got it back. Of course, that little end lag is a bit unfortunate. Yeah. Does actually Ooh, hold his shield. Holds his shield long enough to, to tank the entirety of the down air. 
many players release shield a bit too close or too soon. Oh, but and he then... threw him over the guest register. It's it's to be expected. Oh, he went for it, but it doesn't work, of course. Yoshi can make it back. Okay. And now it's just fishing for it. We have entered the realm of BM. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what you get. Yeah, it gets a nice start up there. Quite strong. But this game is far from over. Definitely. And it's really lasting a pretty long time. At least for matches that I'm usually watching. Yeah, it's uh, almost going to the 4 minute mark. This is a decent combo. Then just greets for the confirm. And then of course you, you tank. Mm. Yeah, he can shoot that cannonball up. Goes for the cross That's up. the wrong way. Oh, yeah. the super armor helps him a lot. It's a bit unfortunate. He got super or he got the, the cross up, but then just shielded. I don't know. This really could go either way right now. I, I doubt that up smash will kill now from the Yoshi, but forward smash definitely will. Forward smash, yeah. up smash, maybe. And the rage. Oh, just, oh no, it doesn't kill yet. Even with this much rage. And this should still not do it. Loses his air to dodge though. And just yeah, comes short. SD! Uh, it's not a hard SD, it's more like a. No, not, it's not a hard one, but still. If we need a compilation, we can always put it in. Sure, sure. <laughs> and that's a, still a 2 0 for Dan, with uh, the King and Rule showing in the tournament. Nice, nice. But uh, yeah, two, we two won't get a pretty close games. Tournaments. Definitely, definitely very close. Uh, we already uh, checked in, right, for our match? Yeah, and this 15 is... minutes ago. Okay, nice. I will take a quick break to go to the bathroom, so uh, entertain the, the peeps. Oh no, this is what I've been fearing all the time. Now I have to entertain people. Oh, oh wait, there's Dan. Congratulations. No. Thank you, thank you. I'm out, no. <laughs> These were some pretty, pretty, pretty interesting matches. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's very close. It's very close, man. I'm, I'm at least improving. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, I'm getting, or I'm getting worse. Either way, I don't like it. <laughs> we were really surprised by the change to uh, k -Roll. Yeah, you just want to play k I, I'm like, I've, he had Green Reptile. Now I also have to play Green Reptile to show who's superior. You didn't want uh, Bowser's up B on Pokemon Stadium 2, did you? No. I <laughs> know. <laughs> um, we are back. Oh, oh he's back again. I just learned to not approach heavies and then suddenly it's really close. <laughs> <laughs> suddenly it works. Whoa. And it works, yeah. I was like, no, oh, this works. So I'm not going to do anything other than not approach. <laughs> no. Uh, I... The problem is more. Um, I have to stay in Cast's room. I guess. Well, yeah, no, you because don't have I'll... to. Right? But, uh, no, oh yeah, they get your passing. Then. Yeah, yeah. So you can. Well, what you can do is just. Uh, uh, I actually no idea how to good approach is good. I um, think uh, just. You do uh, Nuri and you are muted and then. Well, we, we, we I, I have to play. Uh... He has to play against me. Mm -hmm. Misha first. Ooh. So let me just quickly. Oh, yeah, we says he will fight the way. Man, that means I have to cast all games. <laughs> 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 That's what you get for uh, getting out of the tournament. Yeah, you too. can now cast all the games you want. Isn't that a luxury? Not really. Oh. My voice is not gonna like it. <laughs> it's... Uh, it's not like you're gonna need it tomorrow anyway. I can actually just... Uh, not really. I think I can just uh... turn you off in my headset and you are still uh, fine. Um, Alright. Depends if it's a desktop audio. Alright. No, did you... I did you... Uh, put in my... Off? One sec, I'll just uh, put in some ears and some uh, earbuds. One sec. Mm -hmm. Right. Then uh, I'll leave this channel because I don't want to hear you uh, um, 
crap on all of our gameplay. Alright, you can literally just crap on you personally. Yeah, as long as I'm not dead. Man, that's fine. this this Dan Dan guy really sucks, huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, I, I think we're good. I can I can mute you now, and then uh, if somebody uh, can just, uh, confirm uh, in a bit uh, that we still hear the casters, then it's fine. Uh, let me check if we can still hear. We're now ourselves. muted. I don't hear you at all. Alrighty then. Oh, we're really silent, by the way, the casters. You have to turn uh, down and me up. Uh, so yeah, Bit. I don't know how you want to confirm it. Type uh, in chat or if I unmute myself. Do, did you guys still hear each other? Yeah, yeah, uh, we uh, hear each other, but um, it's a bit silent, so you have to increase. A bit, uh, not that much, okay. a bit. Like that? Uh, let me check if it's better now. And I'm not, I'm not too soft in comparison, right? Yeah, it's, it's a bit better. I'm gonna put my mic a bit higher too. Yeah. I'll put a little bit closer okay, to my mouth then, uh, also. I'll put you for oh, you myself. want some ASMR? I'll put you, so <laughs> your guys on mute for me, so uh, good luck casting. All right. Alrighty then. Yeah. Good luck with the game. Good luck, guys. Good luck. So. Right. So, let's see it's how is. bad they are. How <laughs> let's see how fucking awful they are at this game. Uh, <laughs> I mean, Michel uh, uh, told me that he didn't practice during the vacation, so... Ah, mm. that so he's three-ish. He is washed up. He's washed up. He's rusty. He, it's impossible he will win. Oh, I'm a bit okay. loud now, so I'm gonna turn it down then. Alright then. Uh, well, let's see what the first, um, first game is gonna be. be. Probably DDD uh, uh, against Kazuya if, still. If I'm going to have to guess, it's going to be DDD, Kazuya, P Pokemon Stadium 2. Mm, yeah, it's it's like a team this <laughs> today. It's yeah. just Pokemon Stadium 2s. Yeah, exactly, because, well, in my opinion, it's the most neutral stage of them all. Small Battlefield is very similar, but it's just that tiny bit smaller, which means it screws over certain characters. Yeah, I think uh, Casio wants lower roofs, the best zones. Yeah, I think so. so too, because he can combo then into his up special and up smash uh, and then kill earlier. Yep, so I think yes, they're going small Battlefield, because I'm seeing an Aaron's team. It's picking small battlefield. Small battlefield then. Yeah, all right. Yeah, well, small. I, I don't. I don't think any one of them has a big advantage on this stage. It's I think mainly about how uh, well is Michel able to keep uh, Kazuya at di at the distance. Because mm -hmm. as soon as Kazuya gets close, he's combo food and will probably lose a stock in like two hits. Yep. Those forward errors especially. Exactly. But, well, it isn't going done. It is still going pretty even, but yeah, we only like 30 seconds in. And I think <laughs> this will be a kill, no, really. This is probably going to be like a really fast game. So, it's yeah, going to exactly. be over like in a bit, because people are dying really fast in this one. Like, just like yeah, that. <laughs> exactly. It's just not like, oh, wow, special kill setup, so I can kill from this. No, just yeah. a raw forward smash, because of course that works. It's not like uh, Yoshi is struggling to kill something. Like exactly. 100% <laughs> as Michel. It's Kazuya. Kazuya is struggling at killing when he uh, reaches 50. Because <laughs> that's just like a high percentage oh, to survive. He got the and combo off. And is it going to be a follow up and a kill? Dead. Yes, of course. Damn, that's a 40%. Again, the electric into up smash is just so consistent. And the thing is, he can combo basically into it from everything he has. Mm -hmm. But I do notice he's mess messing up some electrics here. Might be washed up, but I think he is gonna destock either way. I, I think he's going to be fine, yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's walk in it. <laughs> going to try thing. to get the cheese off, but it didn't work. Unfortunately, that doesn't Ooh. work at all. Don't to restock. It's comeback but, potential. Yeah, there is. But uh, of course, that's that. Oh, no, no, that. Whoa. Good DI. So, yeah, and I also think it was a sour spot of uh, the special, not the sweet one. And, and that's just kicks. <laughs> that's the forward tilt, I think. That's no, that's not actually the forward tilt. That's like the double forward tilt. So you oh, need the to... double forward tilt, of course. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you need to hold the forward direction, quick back again, and another forward direction, then press A. Mm, okay, okay. That was yeah. a fast game, as you suspected. Yes, of course. We do speed running in this house. Ooh. But all right, let's see. I stay well. 
I wonder if Michel will finally pull out his Sephiroth in the tournament. Because we haven't seen it already and I think it's time for that. I don't think so. He has some practice. He, he, needs, he, he needs some practice with it. I think the one thing I saw Michel do during our uh, game is yeah. he threw a lot of uh, forward or up smashes. Uh, just thinking I would walk in it and it worked like in the first match. But then <laughs> I, I noticed that he just does that, so I'm just waiting until that happens. I think Aaron's got it a lot sooner, uh, that habit. Yeah, Aaron's is uh, quite good at uh, reading that stuff and punishing it accordingly. Yep. I, I think Aaron's already played enough uh, against D to know that uh, the uh, Gerudo at in the beginning of the match just just to deflect it. <laughs> <laughs> I think so too. But let's see. I'm going it. to Pokemon Almost... Stadium too. <laughs> Interesting. Like we haven't seen that one before. Yeah. Pokemon Stadium. Where is the uh, where what's the other map called? That's a fun map. Final destination. Final destination. Well, I don't think that will be such a good idea. I think that will be heavily in uh, uh, Kazuya's favor. Because mm. Kazuya's main thing is his awful jump squad, and that means he can't utilize platforms all as well, because then he always has to go for a hard read. Uh, this way, he uh, if there aren't any platforms, Kazuya limits like the the places his opponent can go. Oh, he got several. <laughs> oh wow, he actually going several. Let's go. First, first time on stream, a Sephiroth gameplay from Michel. Shirtless Sephiroth against shirtless Kazuya. It's gonna be a hot match, guys. Oh no. <laughs> Oh so no, that's... he's hot! So now the range defense is for the Sephiroth. Exactly, but there's one problem. Sephiroth dies incredibly early. One of the lightest characters in the game. Mm. For some those, reason. Those uh, purple balls, I don't know what's called, side bees, are gonna fuck uh, his combos up. And Michel seems to have a big advantage at the moment. I think Ash just has trouble uh, adapting to the, well, new character. And I think oh, that's just it's already. Just that's <laughs> that. Oh, he's survived. Oh, he still lives. Well, it's an even game still. It's just like who gets a hill first. Uh, okay, never mind. I can't It's characters with combat mechanics. Why the DLC stuff, you know, mate? No, I reset, I guess. Is there nothing happened? Yeah, seems like we just began only. And I think this will again be such a quick game because both the characters can kill so incredibly quickly. Mm -hmm. Oh, just like that. Oh, almost a kill. 99% of several. Getting the uh, one winged age off. But now is it, will he be able to utilize it? Is the problem. Well, the question more. Uh, he got a counter down. I think that's the broken move he needs to spam. <laughs> well, the online broken move, right? There is like a problem with that counter because if Ant's counters like reflects that counter, Michel is instantly dead from 0% already. Oh. <laughs> So That's another comeback mechanic, and he just does the forward tilt. And now is the, now is my next question: Will Ernst keep his uh, rage, or will he just use it for some uh, quick damage, and then just try to kill his regular way? Because I think this will kill at like 40. But he just used a 25 for damage, with still 40 percent damage. Still 40 percent, yeah. No, oh, oh, that's death that, for that's several. That. Yeah. That's that. But he got the stuck off. <laughs> that. Damn, Michel. Great ID, but next time maybe make sure you have an extra stock ready, just in case. I think yeah, Michel died first too. Yeah, he died with his honor. He got it. <laughs> At least he uh, he didn't get two stocks right. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, but here we saw Michel's uh, Sephiroth de debut. So that makes it that uh, Forkman has to go against Brocky Rocking. Yeah. And in the losers finals now, Daniel Bananio has to go against Deport. Uh, or let's yes. losers semi-finals, not losers finals. Yes. Um, so what's easier to do with streaming? What match do we want to do first? Um, I guess against Nori first, when it's finals. I guess, sure. Or is it... Um, if we do that, then the winner has to wait a very long time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, then let's just semi final I think that yeah, would be a bit healthier. I mean, uh, uh, Nori already waited so long, by the way. I'm yeah. not sure. <laughs> I'm also down just to do that. If, uh, yeah. Then it will be me and Michel, I think, yeah? Yeah. All right. 
sounds good to me. Okay, I don't so, know if Nuri is still here. Um, probably watching the uh, stream. Discord, yeah, he's still okay. online on Discord. Say hi in the chat if you're here, Nuri. <laughs> what the? <laughs> or it's like nice. a funny emoji. Um, right, I, I will be going to the. Oh well, he is waiting in the voice channel. Oh, he's waiting in the voice. I think you, could, you might as well just play it because he uh, has been a, a while since he had a chance to okay, play. Yeah, but I of yeah. course have to stay here in caster, so the, he does not know. Caster. He does not know here. Uh, he does not know the. ID and the password. He does not oh, know. Uh, it is. It, it, you can find it's it on this still my room. Yeah. I'll just notify him. Sounds good. Hmm. Then we'll do some lovely casting. It just don't scare me. Whoa. No. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's deep, man. Yeah, mate. So you were afraid of the. of the fur, of vowel, or whatever it's called. Be there, be square. You're, you're, so you're always there. I'm just scared of edges. Like I had, <laughs> I had spent my whole uh, how do you call it morning fixing some edges for a graph. <laughs> I was right. a bit sad though that I couldn't face you in the tournament, Akam, because I was practicing some combos on Yoshi. <laughs> oh no! I I mean, you you saw how I improved too. <laughs> True. He's playing defensive. I am playing actually defensive on Yoshi. <laughs> I'm not he... going ahead this uh, in like a headless chicken. But why not? That's a fun thing. F fun thing. <laughs> yeah, for you. Yeah, for me. Yes, of course. Because I just tank the damage and die. Now you, now you guys have to sweat. Do not lose against a what rank am I again? Eight or seven? You're seven. <laughs> seven. Oh my God, not even top five. We need. <laughs> <laughs> nah. He's messing around. Mm, yep. Alright, so, while we're waiting on Nori, what is the prediction here? I expect Falco Ooh, I shouldn't, I shouldn't hear this. Kazuya. I shouldn't hear this, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Uh, I expect Ants to lose terribly. Just, yeah, just because. Yeah. Seems not just the match, but also his friends. Uh, I will exactly. already mute myself to not uh, hear anything from you, so... <laughs> well, okay, here yeah, we go bye. again. Alright, so, good luck. Alright, hey, I think Ants is going to lose awfully again. I just want to re re reiterate that, just to be mm. sure. Okay, okay. Well, if we look at it in another way, like in rock, paper, scissors kind of sense, scissors are the same materials as how a fork is made. Right? Yeah, but, yeah, but not, what does it to do with birds? What? Birds? <laughs> yeah, because he's playing a bird. No, 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 it's, it's about his name. Oh, about his name? It's, oh, it's a fork. Rock. You didn't yeah, get you... that. If it's gonna, yeah, I, of course I get it. But you can also make it's a high IQ stuff. meme. I'm sorry. Of course, high IQ meme. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I should stop trying to be funny. Um. <laughs> nah. But in uh, my opinion, uh, I think uh, this can be quite an even match. I don't. I'm not very familiar with the Falco Kazuya matchup because that's what I expect. Because those are both their mains, unless one of them goes for me like a uh, ship post and comes up with something stupid like Mr. Gamer Watch. But uh, no, that's a con. Uh, I'm the Mr. Shit post. Mr. Shit post, of course. <laughs> Mr. Shit and post. Uh, I think yeah. it will either be uh, Kazuya Falco or maybe Pikachu Ooh, Falco. Pikachu. If he that he's struggling with Kazuya. He he picked Pikachu on stream. He picked Pikachu, <laughs> of course, because he already jinxed with Kazuya. <laughs> yeah, I do understand that because, well, one of Kazuya's bigger struggles is, of course, his aerial prowess, which Falco excels at, so... Pikachu Actually, is... he prefers the air. Mm. Ex exactly. And going by uh, Pokemon logic, we uh, have a Tinder against flying. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. He has a hope stage advantage. But he has mirror code, so he can just reflect it again. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> No, this also... is gonna be a combo happy game, uh, not as fast as the others. I think the get, this will be a quite slow game. And Aerith threw, has thrown out some side specials, which I think were meant to be up specials. Probably. <laughs> Already fat fingering or missing. Oh, of course, it would be a smash tournament without fat fingering. That's the best part about it. That's the way I, I went neutral with fat fingering random stuff. I thought the best part was not having to shower. 
Nah. That's uh, when you're in an actual physical tournament. Now you, ah, it's right. a lice, so you do have to shower. But you don't have to put on any deodorant. But, uh, but let's see. <laughs> the, <I> <laughs> the game is still quite even at the moment. And no. that is it's becoming less even. And Pikachu just barely uh, well, escapes that up here from Falco. And I it's think a bit it's risky doing those updates like that. Yeah. It's nice. It's, uh, Forkmon I think is trying his uh, signature up, up air. Forkmon getting work. the 69 kill. Nice. Nice. <laughs> it is canon in the game that you get a power boost at a percentage. Mm. I believe that immediately. Oh, and we got a combo game, but we can't finish it yet. Ooh. I think Falco is just a bit too floaty for it to be, well, comboed efficiently by Pikachu. Pikachu mainly benefits from big fast fallers. Because then it can do stuff like up air bridges and all the other uh, creative shit. Oh, going for the edge. Uh, yeah. oh, and we got it. We got the roll. Nice. Got the roll read. Nice. But still, advantage for fourth one. Oh, we make sure to not get mm. games there. That was close. If that spiked. It was pretty close. Falco's upbeat doesn't really go as far as you'd think. No, not really. It, it looks far, but it doesn't. It's it's just because he has a huge jump. Yeah, it's double jump. Fox is supposed to wait further. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's... oh I went for Almost it. Almost the center. Oh, oh got the pair in. I have a feeling it doesn't kill. Oh! oh. Ooh, that could have. <laughs> Sniped him out of the quick attack. You don't see that often. That's good thing. Brock just, uh, <laughs> Brock just has issues with getting in there. He just uh, he doesn't really have the tools to like. Well, his, air his own arrows aren't big, good enough to challenge focus aerials. I think he should rely more on his jolt. Just spam that shit and then do follow up. Then you can just oh, get <laughs> I, I, Why do I keep jinxing it? Why do they keep messing with me? You don't give advice to pro players, of course. Come Otherwise, no, we don't have comedians. Still the oh. lead for fourth one. Uh, Ernst can make this a comeback. He misses the cloud on the down B. That's quite unfortunate. I don't think that uh, he can combo into his, uh, uh, down B anymore, the Thunder. But uh, I think this best option right now is going for a raw smash attack or a read. Because I don't think he's any combos at Falco at the moment. No, he's he's struggling to no. get the kill in, but the dash attack almost no. does it. But it's not that simple, Aaron. But it's actually not so that simple to kill. And that's on. Well, it must have grown stale, probably. Um, he has used the quite some while, yeah. Uh, Just bugs in the lasers. Oh, and uh, that's the dash attack kill. Of it's course, an the classic. It's a mechanic that you can crouch under things. Yep. Why doesn't it work for Bowser then? Because he's huge. Not Pikachu fair. is small. You're a turtle, and you're still so fast. Bowser. Oh, Turtles aren't that, uh, aren't that slow, uh, in actually. The ocean. In the ocean. Yeah. But actually, on land, they can actually sprint at quite fast fa speed. It's just that you don't usually see them do that. Well, then they're quite bad sprinters. Um, <laughs> or just, just lazy. But right now, it seems to have even up a bit, but yeah, still the small advantage. Up. Still the small advantage for Forkmon. Forkmon has the kill potential. I think any of his aerials could be the except for that one. He is getting that. Oh, oh he got almost, almost a down tilt. I if think even... can get one combo uh, with a thunder. Oh, and uh, the smash kills it. He would have won, but no. So Ooh, sad. Are we in a time where Pokemon actually becomes the rank one? Except, By the way, um, it's still my name on the thing. And uh, that's the layout. <laughs> I hope Ernst realizes it soon. Lies! <laughs> Lies! I mean, I would like a win right now, but. <laughs> now, nah, you see, that that's just the Vorkman. You just uh, need to uh, pr you pronounce it differently, you see. Oh, wait, I get it. Because you see, because the D is just for the D, and the Vo is just like Vork, and eat, yeah. The Vorkman, yes, that works. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, new stage selection, small Bellfield. Small Bellfield. 
always a nice place, but will he switch from Pikachu, I wonder? Because it was a quite an uneven match, but you did notice that he had trouble with, well, getting combos off. Oh, he, which he's is stopping. Going to Kazuya, maybe, I think. Yeah, Kazuya, my boy. <laughs> Kazuya. He's going back to what he's comfortable with. Yeah. This is main. This is what the character practices most, so I expect many things from this. <laughs> Let's see if he can beat this Falco. Getting first hit it by multiple up tilts. But the classic. <laughs> the because she does more damage. Oh that auto turn mechanic is so good to Kazuya. You don't even have to aim, it's like out to aim. Exactly. Oh, what uh, happened what? there? What there? We got an SD for the SD compilation! Yay! <laughs> at, at the 5 seconds SD compilation. Well, we got we got one. Um, <laughs> we can maybe count yours account. That wasn't an SD, I just didn't... I was just too far out. <laughs> well, this is... Uh... Interesting. It looks like a difficult matchup for Kazuya. Mm, Seems yeah, like he's yeah. getting comboed on. It, it doesn't yeah. see. Has the combo mechanics though to get back. The... Is he allowed to get back on stage? And oh, oh, he, oh, he got... flex the laser. Oh. Seems like he. And an up smash. Oh. This is gonna be a three stock. He, I still, think just... that uh, Fogman is going to get uh, top two. At, At least. least. At least top two. I mean, this is the winners finals after all, so. <laughs> <laughs> As well, nah, you just came third because we said. Yeah, didn't you know we had a secret competitor? Oh, it's a sick challenger. Approach is like a heli, a heli challenger, yeah. Maybe the one that which is uh, at the bottom of the ranking. Just suddenly shows up. Claps Astro. everyone. Astro. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's, that's uh, rope. <laughs> rope. Anyway, can Kazuya make a comeback? It is possible. Kazuya is no for his comeback, Shenanigans. Um, he only can make like one comeback, but the upbeat does kill. But it's not the nice percentage, sadly. No. Unfortunate. Oh, he gets the co uh, early yeah, combo off. Combo. That's he of course can the biggest turn problem. This really easily around if he gets this early kill right here with the 10 hit combo, but he gets shot out of it. Of course, that's the, the biggest problem with Kazuya. If he can't oh. get in, then he can't really do anything. And Falco he is, of course, pretty nimble. Got it, but and the down tilt, the down tilt does it. Damn, that sends out really far. Up. That's unfortunate. Getting massacred, I would say. Yeah, it just did not work. I think the Pikachu was a much closer match, but oh, I was you would have to try so, it out. So hard that match. Congrats to Nori going to the grand finals. Good games from him. You're gonna have to wait a bit though, because first we're gonna get another match. Two more uh, losers brackets matches. We're gonna get the semi-finals, the finals, and finally the grand finals. Or. Whoa. Well, wait, grand finals best Ooh. of five, by the way. A live announcement of Dan. Yeah, you can get your jerseys if you're a Zephyrman. <laughs> get your you jerseys, one. people. If, if you yeah, ordered one. If you ordered a jersey, you can pick them up next week and make them for them, Martel. Exactly. But what if I'm not a Zephyr member? How, how can I get one jersey? First, Good. you sign up on the Zephyr website, ASAPZephyr.nl. And, and there you sign up to become a server. Uh, yes. And then you can and get a nice jersey that we just talked about. Yes. Yes. Oh. But you first have to pay contribution and fix your sports card. That, that's a small letter. You don't say the small letters now. I want money. <laughs> but, uh, I believe we have We're a match ready. Mr. Perhaps. Is the match ready? I see everyone on the spectators room. Oh yeah. We... <laughs> We're going to watch a ghost. Ghost fight or something like that, but nice. I think I have to play. Yes, you have to play against me. All right, then, Michel. I guess we will be going to a voice channel. Yeah, so we're going Gosters. to number three. Specific reason why number three? I just didn't want to go to one. Fine by me. Mm. All okay. right, see you guys. He likes to be an old one. Wait, is it now? 
It's not let's do. Oh, this overview is so annoying. <laughs> yeah, it's a, a bit annoying. How can I have to I just... change it constantly. The only thing I want to change is um, the number of matches. So best of five for Grand and Losers finals. Oh, you want to change that? I'm not sure how you can change it. I believe I got it. Sefer won, yes. Sefer always wins. Best of five, save. Oh, you mean, uh, you mean the uh, game which is going on right now? The uh, Inside Esports one. Oh, That's nice. Sefer boys. Also, Ratio them. I saw some people on the viewing channel, so take it now, watch this, right? <laughs> Show some support to the internal Smash tournament. So if Da Bananio and Fursitter but okay. face up, who would win? Hmm. That's an interesting question. I would say that Daniel Bananio, he has more experience. Yeah, Fursitter was just for like one tournament and we have never seen him again since then. Finished an embarrassing second place. Yeah. Really bad performance there <laughs> by Fursitter. <laughs> So hopefully we'll see more of Daniel and Daniel. But I want the old Daniel Bananio, how you say it, like the uh, old mango rap. No, Whereas the old Daniel Bananio, this Yoshi Daniel Bananio. It doesn't roll off the tongue though. No, it's, it's really long, <laughs> it's too long a name. So yeah, I think we'll we'll see a uh, only DDD Bowser matchup for the whole best of the three. Probably, I, I'm, uh, he can try to go Sephiroth, um, and Dan can go try to King K. Rule. Uh, I would say he has a little bit more success with Sephiroth against his Bowser, yeah, but I don't know, comfort is also a big part, of course. It works better for Akboy or Defoy, yeah, but there's no, no old Akboy, I'm always the Yoshi Akboy. Actually sealed the Incineroar here from Dan. Incineroar? Yeah. Dan is just going all out of his roster. Showing all what he's up. On FD as well. Okay, suddenly there's no Kazuya, so we can just go to FD. Ooh. Yeah, no <laughs> more Pokemon see him too. Hmm. Oh, that's. Okay, never mind, it's buffed. Incineroar got his FD buffed sometime. Yeah, so we go from Yoshi up pairs to Incineroar up pairs. Basically, it's the same combos for most of the characters. But also I don't for know. Falco. It, it is a bit risky because, of course, one hit off stage and it's done for the Incineroar. True, and Incineroar is already at 100. So anything can kill. He got the revenge off, and this, he misses it. That, that doesn't consume the revenge, luckily. It doesn't. Oh, a little bit greedy there. He just gets away with it. You know, goes indeed for the ledge. Gets back on stage. Almost as easy. But gets it. Anyway. First, the stock advantage goes to uh, neither. Default, but it's <laughs> now neither. As the game has stabilized the game. Mm. I see that as a, as a decent trend here, that the first stock is the by far the closest one and then people do not dis respect the invincibility timing when you respawn as much as they shoot. So then they just go too ham early and then they lose like 30% for free. Yeah, that mo most of the time happens. Oh, I got a nice up there. Yeah, it's a, a su surprisingly consistent when uh, facing the incendiary. You can just always throw that out without really any risks. Is this it for the Incineroar? If you can get bet Oh, you got it. You got it over here. He actually turned the Gordo for himself. Yeah. And got the test second. The Creed Let's see. Forge and it's... Oh, it doesn't kill it. It's pistol. Let's see if Dan can do anything with his stock advantage. Nope. He got 50% off. 
it's actually huge that uh, Devoid finally started using Updelt in this game plan. It's such a clean and fast kill move on DVD. Yeah, Updelt is actually really slow. I like to see them a lot more instead of the, the forward smashes. Uh... <laughs> the forward smashes are so slow and it's a bit predictable. Like them. Just get punished by it. We managed to get one more hit off on the super armor on the Cynodor, but unfortunately it does go through. Oh, oh it just got, gets the hit in. Yeah, we, we can make an old jet hammer kill uh, compilation at this point. I mean, two of, <laughs> two of me, I think. Yeah, two of yours uh, on the Kalos. And the other one was, I believe, was the forward smash? I don't know. <laughs> um, I am not sure. The chat hammer is really good for that edge two frames. Yeah, actually, and of course, the Cinder with such a linear recovery is just exploitable. Yep. It's only really one or two ways for Cinder to get back on stage. But uh, I think uh, Dan has had his fun now, and he will switch back to the Bowser, I think. Yeah, I think he just wanted to show it to stream. Mm -hmm. <laughs> After the first stop, weak mental. You just go mental goes boom after first stops if you lose it. You will lose your mental when your opponent's at 200% and you can't kill it. <laughs> yeah. Those damn heavies. Yep. But uh, not the first game I was, I was expecting, but uh, pleased to see. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if we're gonna see any changes still. Oh, it's the classic. Back to the Bowser. The mains are getting uh, pulled out again. Mm -hmm. oh, and a small battlefield as well. I would say small one of battle. Bowser's best stages. Because of the uh, low death zone. Yeah, the sides and the, the top are just minuscule. But it might also be advantage for um uh, devoid getting that fast skills and normally maybe. i would say yeah but i think bowser is the the one who just out damages him and out spaces the ddd oh i mean yeah also the nice wee music but again a pretty close first stop here both at the 100 percent but then again, DDD has to actually <laughs> yeah. try for one of the, big, the <laughs> bigger hits, while Bowser can just more chill with tilts and uh, get the kills easy. Oh. Yes, back on stage. Both on kill percentage. Gets the grab, but we can't follow it up. Stop with the forward smashes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, there was the forward smash again. <laughs> We should just have a counter on screen with uh, four smashes. Yeah, <laughs> that will be a lot of work. Yes. True. Bowser just grabs and eats him <laughs> off <laughs> after that. It is not the, the biggest kill throw in the game, but it, it's still something you have to respect. You cannot just walk up on the Bowser with full rage and uh, while you're you're at 150%. Come on. Let's see if we can see any kill moves for the coming out. Yes. Picking a jet hammer. Oh, uh, and an arm it. is through <laughs> it. <laughs> of course. Add it to the list. Another jet hammer. Oh. Hmm. Down airs are yeah. killing just. Are not killing barely, but uh, I think two more of those and it's done for the DD. A side B would do it as well here. Or uh, do it to the face, it's also. Ooh, with all the, the sniping. Well, I, I would say it's unlikely that, that DDD picks the stock here, but like 10% more would be nice. The up D kill, so. Mm. Let's see if he gets an early kill with the forward smash, but it doesn't. <laughs> it's shield through. Oh, the dash attacks just clips him. I think it was a two frame. Yeah, it's actually one of them. I think now it's it's not technically, I believe, a two frame. It, it stays active a lot longer, but uh, still very nice to call out the recovery. That goes through the platform. Too fat. 
Oh, does not get the forward area. I think he was looking for, but set it Oh, there. but the forward smashes Maxim on the head and kills it. And that's uh, <laughs> Dan out of the tournament. That's Dan out of the tournament, yeah. Dan not having a game today. So I will meet Devoid in the best of five. Okay, okay. Hmm. The first best of five. That means the next one on the ranking list, if we have one, is uh, Dan. From second place to fourth place. I can just uh, let the void on the layout. Like that. Damn, did not expect it. Yeah, close game. Close games. Then we'll see um, you, Brocky Brocky, <laughs> against uh, Michel. Yeah. Boy. A little bit more time to clean up my game plan. Yep. Is this going to be a best of five? Yes. The last two right. sets will be uh, best of five. Then let's see what's uh, let's see what's up there. Yes. Hello there. Mm -hmm. Hey. Explosive it's content. Very yeah. explosive. Oh. The Incineroar <laughs> trying to get it in, but couldn't work it out. Yeah, unfortunately, but hey, that's just, that's just magic. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Mm -hmm. Call it a 50-50 win rate. Point left. Exactly. It has oh, been well. a well. Yeah. Alright, but then I can go back to casting the entire oh. tournament. <laughs> Whoa! Yo. Uh, hey, that, yeah, that means that Voorzitter is better than Daniel Bananio. It is <laughs> true, yes. It is confirmed. Undisputable evidence right here on Twitch. <laughs> but uh, uh, I I, think... uh, I will mute myself again, so I'll leave it to you guys uh, for the casting. The first best uh, five. Alright, alright, good luck. Uh, don't, don't forget to fix the, the title shit uh, like Devoid and Pokebee B. And it's, it's, already, it's already good. It's all, all right. It's all taken care of. Alright, alright. Good to know. Yes, okay, I'm gonna go. Ooh. Okay. I think it's time for you to go back to uh, Yoshi's down. This is a sign. Maybe, maybe. You already Who saw knows? how good Yoshi was for me. Exactly, yeah, maybe. Maybe I also need to play um, a bit more. By the way, I need yeah. to quickly go to uh, Michel, so one moment. Oh. Michel? Ja. Ik moet je officieel wel even de rules, de moves geven natuurlijk voor de Mi Brawler. Oh ja, ja. Dus ik heb de standaard die, die uppercut, de UB, de put shot, de, de bal. Ja. De, wat was het? De flame kick, een side B en de neutral B is. Oh nee, een down B is flip kick. Ja? Yeah? Oké. Okay. Ja. Yeah. Goed luck. Goed luck. Ik heb een tafeltje voor jou. Yeah. <laughs> okay. My uh, table uh, broke or something like that. It's a bit broken. Yeah. <laughs> for the people in chat, you can find it in the separate Twitch channel. Clip. In my opinion, that clip should have won the entire thing. Yeah, we kind of forgot about your evo, but I think <laughs> uh, that would have been rigged. <laughs> it's, it was a good clip, though. I it warned him. I didn't know what he was doing. I was like moving my box on the, on, on the table. I was like, what the fuck is he doing? And then he just moved my table. I was like, no, don't. No! That's not a good idea. <laughs> I thought it was it hilarious. Was yep, it's a great one. Ooh, I also forgot to upload the YouTube video today. So don't blame me if there's no YouTube video today. God damn. <laughs> it's, it's a lot of work, man. It's like five hour faults. Oh, wow. Oh, snipes it. Is that a kill? Can Is that a kill? Oh, my god. Yeah, yeah. He actually looks awful. Yeah, the me, he goes to the me brawler. Which is just, I think, Cassia. <laughs> oh man. Better Cassia. Holy. Is that even Cassia? It looks like Cassia. Yeah, but it's, it's, it's like his dad. It's supposed to be his dad, I think. Is that his dad, though? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because his dad has like the mustache. Oh. And the, and the more, even more pointy hair. Oh. 
I mean, if you if you remove the mustache, it kind of looks like Kasia. Yeah, you know, would also look like your dad if you have a mustache. Um, if he had a mustache, I don't know. He doesn't. <laughs> it's all right. Um, well, yeah, a three stock right now, getting a seventy percent stock lead, a seventy percent stock advantage, which is becoming bigger and bigger as we speak. Maybe getting the kill off there. Couldn't land that one. Michel has some trouble to kill it, and we have another a big, big lead for bro. Getting into the combo. Another combo. No, it doesn't miss, but the up smash kills it. Let's see if Michel can bring this back. It's a lot difficult. It's difficult for Michel to get back because no comeback mechanics for him. But you do have the jet hammer. Oh, charge the forward smash and oh, <laughs> it's Ooh. Of course. The GD sucks up stuff. I wonder oh. uh... Oh. Uh, I uh, yeah, I didn't can do that. This is still. Oh, never mind. The I, I, won't, <laughs> I won't say. Oh, this is still everybody's game. Fucking dies. <laughs> I won't say it. Well, you're good that you're not. Did not say it. <laughs> oh man, man, man. But that's the first game goes to Brock B. Brocking. Yeah. And well, it. I wouldn't say it was a uh, starter or something like that, but it seems like Michel really had some trouble getting into it. Yeah, uh, I think Michel did not expect the Mii Brawler and has to adapt to that Mii Brawler. I guess so too, yeah, but Mii Brawler is such a deviation for the other characters that Aaron spilled. Plays. <laughs> <laughs> True. Yes, yes, English. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I uh, al al always love to just put shitting down the arena that people are like super confused, like, what, why? But I'm the leader. <laughs> 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 But I think uh, Ants has a quite good advantage because of his car character knowledge because he plays three very different characters because because we have Pikachu and me Brawler well and sometimes <laughs> Falco he got and... the Falco <laughs> why oh, not the Falco he got the, the Captain Falcon I mean yeah the Captain Falcon yeah. uh, yes Captain Obvious my favorite <laughs> and Michel <laughs> may change from character oh uh, this is DD again uh, it's the DDD special yeah but let's see if Aaron just wants to flex with his falcon, or if it actually is substantial, uh, if he actually going to use it properly. I expect yeah. many knees. Many, many knees. knees. Oh, walks into the forest smash. It works. It works. That's why he's doing it. <laughs> yeah, the great thing about Michel's neutral is that he basically doesn't have a neutral. He just spam smash attacks. Yep. <laughs> and it just works. And of course, Gordos. You can't forget Gordos. Yeah. And Gordos are easy. You can just hit it back. Yeah. But Aaron skips going for that up smash, which is actually great. Did you know Ooh, that up smash? Nice attack dash attack. Yeah. But did you know that up smash of Captain Falcon can actually two frame on the ledge <laughs> for some for some reason? Ooh. I don't know. Oh. Yeah, I mean, currently looking at Aaron, he's going for those plays. I think he is trying to get those highlight plays. Getting the Falcon Punch um, interrupted and that spike too. And maybe a knee or something like uh, in there, but he isn't he isn't really able to kill at the moment, even though Cut Falcon has quite good kill moves. Oh. And uh, down oh, tilt! Uh, no, that's a down tilt, yeah. Also such a great kill move, but not as flashy as I think he would hope. And he runs again into a forward smash. <laughs> it just works, man. It just works. Just a copium for some while. <laughs> copium, mm, yes. Uh, Always works. It's nice. Oh, I almost did it again. <laughs> it jumps over it. Another it forward it smash. Another one. Oh, Not again! Oh. No! <laughs> Stop me, Shell, please! Oh, <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright, let's go into the highlight view. Uh, then, Ernst, uh, Ernst was already talking about the cast that he, Michel does a lot of forward smash and it's not really good. Stop but, uh, going forward smash at Michel, please! You're making yeah, me sad! 
it, it just works on errands, I guess. No! <laughs> hey, why, why is stop if it works, right? Well, it, it, it makes me sad that it works. <laughs> Who needs neutral when you, go, you can just spam smash attacks? It's just... Please stop. <laughs> oh, getting a smash attack again. Oh. But the worst thing is, it doesn't punish you properly. We haven't seen any knees yet. No. And I'm quite surprised by that. I think he needs to get like a neutral air, but not like the first hit, or he needs like a weak hit up air to confirm into it. Uh, but I, I think, think he needs some miracle. Also, he needs yeah. a miracle. Oh. And up kill. Such a good move. Such a good move. Ernst, an upset, huh? Didn't expect that one. Getting too stocked by the DDD. Yeah. Um, I think that Ernst was trying to get something off with Captain Falcon, but he's going to switch back to his old mains. I think so too. I don't think Captain Falcon works here that well. Nope, it does not. Yeah. Hmm. It is a. Get the is in my opinion a good character, but get uh, the get the main thing is that he's very quick and that he has long limbs, which he, c he can use for decent spacing, which doesn't help a lot if your character has a bigger hammer, which is even better at spacing. <laughs> yep, yep. It do be like that. It do be like that. Quite a problem. Um... But let's see what's going to happen now. Will and switch? I hope so. <laughs> but maybe Michel will also pull a sneaky on him and change to Sephiroth or maybe even Bayonetta. Hmm. A lot of options, but I think he is keeping with the DD since it works out right now. It works great out for him, he's already in third place, I think. That's an improvement from last time. Let's see where they will be going. He's going I'm to keep getting... Captain Falcon or. I'm betting on Smashville. No, Big Battlefield. But Big Battlefield. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, hold on a minute. <laughs> oh, it's just a normal Battlefield. Regular Battlefield. <laughs> That's why, yeah, we just decided to make Big Battlefield legal. Just because. Do, do you hate heavies? Yes, so you play Big Battlefield. Because why not? Might as well. Could you just imagine? Just all the heavy. <laughs> Could you imagine the side special shenanigans you could pull with Bowser on that stage? Kill at like 60 with that uh, command grab? No, I'm just imagining trying to get an early kill and then just stalling for like 6 minutes. Yeah, that's because you play Yoshi. That, that your thing is stalling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's this character. <laughs> Man. But... I've played games against Game of Watch and those games go up to the diamonds and cylinders. <laughs> oh god. So you're lucky no one here plays Game of Watch besides me. <laughs> Uh, we're and, and very lucky. Okay. Yeah, I get. It. I don't know if he's still a member. <laughs> no, Alright, so. but well. at the moment, Ernst is at the funny number, so maybe and he's gone from the funny number. Nah, those those are temporary. Okay. That's a good. Um, and that's oh, a kill. The dash another attack. dash attack kill, yeah. Only ninety ninety percent. That's such a good move, the dash attack. It just kills in two frames and stays at for so oh, long. And then... What? what an upset, my! <laughs> it's, um, I did not uh, expect uh, that. An SD count on the two, I think, right now. So a wall, st a wall stock advantage, but let's not forget that Ernst is playing a DLC character, so he has the ways to make a comeback. Yeah, but it's quite difficult. It, it, well, it is going his way at the moment, but if Misha can uh, hit another, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, th I thought he was going for the mission technique, just uh, spam forward smash, it just works. Yeah, it works. He gets maybe an early kill here. Maybe. I don't know what he's going Ooh, to do. That doesn't do it. Nah, he's a heavy boy. Uh, and killing from up top is also not that good. Oh, that could kill. That could have actually killed up smash. Yep. Oh my god. Now, this but is going to be interesting. 88%. One is it possible? Smash and it's done. Well, you, oh, and they're basically, uh, well, they're almost even again. And they're even. 
It's even now, the SD didn't count. And nice. the SD got the comeback with the up smash. Nice, nice. Wow. Uh, King predictions, did Michelle participate last time? Yes. Uh, I, currently, um, I am with Dan, who lost. Um, I Jeremy. lost. He I was second place in the ranking, I think. Last time I was second in the ranking. I came second place. And now uh, he's fourth. Yes. And because I, I was stuck. I was eighth and now I am fifth, if that's how it works. <laughs> of course that's how it works. How do you mean? <laughs> nah. It's uh, all good fun and games. Yep. Uh Vorgman was third last time and now he's in at least second place because he's still in the winner's bracket. Yeah, Vorgman getting an upset. And um uh, this is best of five, right? So we still have two last, matches. Still no, it's two matches. Uh, last match for uh, match. It's game point. No, it's match point for Brock. Really? Yep. He is already two. It's two one. Oh yeah, two one. Yeah, you're correct. Yeah, I forgot that for a But he is not like updating the the overlay. Oh no. Nah. And so he well, Yeah, Michel did partic participate last time. But uh, it seems like Michel has improved quite a bit. Oh, oh we... Michel going with the Sephiroth. Sephiroth. Good choice. I think if, if he plays his character well with the spacing stuff, he can def he can easily take this game. But now it is a thing. I hope he doesn't spend forward smash because now that can be punished very heavily by Kazuya. Getting grabbed. Uh oh. And oh, oh. eyes there. <laughs> now it's just 50% percentage. Now he definitely win, and he's gone. Oh, and again, the, I think that was the forward smash. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's not the character base now. Yeah. That's oh, just kills immediately after getting the one wing angel. Now he, now he, I think he hopes to kill uh, Aaron before he gets another one winged angel. Because that would be a waste of that, uh, well, buff. But it seems like it will be Paul. Yeah, there we go. He got it at 90. I don't think that's worth any die. Yeah, this is quite a fast match. We've not even been a minute. Uh, not even been a minute. Oh, that's finishable. And that's 23% for you. Okay. But because he didn't use the special command grab. Oh, it's the not the special command. Yeah, but for some reason you can decide which one you use. Because that does, seems totally fair and balanced. And that's one he used at the 70%. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's, it's getting into a tree stock. Getting countered. Oh. Nice, nice. No tree stock. But maybe this is the beginning. Well, oh, never mind. <laughs> again, it's again that food just kills people. It just works. But this means that we will be going to the grand finals between Brock B. Brocking and Vorkman. Ooh. The number one, uh, B. Brocking, number one of last time, and Vorkman, the number three of last time. Who yeah. will win this? It will but be quite tense. Don't forget, Brock B. Brocking. Um... Already lost to Vorkman in the winner's bracket. Exactly, and he has to take two sets of Vorkman now, which can be quite difficult. Because Kazuya is quite a high demand character for you, and maybe difficult for him to like keep the focus for the entire two sets through. Mm, yeah. There, do we, yeah. Indeed, Sogi, there needs to be a bracket reset, because, yeah. Bra because Brock will be coming from losers, uh, from the loser bracket. The grand finals, yeah, you can see the L on Brock BB. Exactly. I'm this taking, will be interesting. I'm taking desperate measures. <laughs> <laughs> During the first match, I felt my stomach rumbling because I only ate half my meal because it was far too spicy. So I'm dunking down two peanut butter sandwiches. Mm. <laughs> Do you need a bathroom, bathroom break, maybe? Nope. <laughs> just my peanut or, butter. Just the peanut butter, all right. The peanut butter buff. Um, confirm. But uh, why did you choose get the Falcon all of a sudden? That surprised me as well. Felt like it. <laughs> I wanted to test something, and it was indeed something that I shouldn't go anymore because I'm not feeling fast characters this tournament. The Pikachu went didn't feel right, nice. The Me Brawler felt off, and then the Falcon also. So I thought, nah. And the Falcon looked like you were going trying to go. To do something special, <laughs> like something flashy, like knees and falcon bridges and stuff like that. But uh, it's fine, it's fine. Um, so we're going, to, so we're going to guess you're going to take the tournament a bit slower. Um, we'll see. We'll see. All right. 
I'm intrigued about this match will uh, how, how the set will turn out or these sets. Mm. No, no, I only mm. did it because now if you look at the bracket, it says that I played Mibrala and Captain Falcon in the <laughs> losers finals. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> That's all we do it for, baby. And now, uh, Michel, your third place in the ranking, right? Higher oh, than last time. Higher oh, yeah, than last time, true. I'll put feels the great. amazing uh, command by Steven one more in the chat. The exclamation point bracket. Super handy. There oh is. yeah, I see it. And don't know if it's answered already, but uh, yeah, Sogi, I participated last time. Let's yeah. uh, do a shout out to Steven for uh, setting up stuff for this. I don't know how difficult it is to do that with a bot, but it's always nice to have that function. Let's go, uh, IT committee. Ooh. In IT, IT. <coughs> I'm still waiting for the check in from Forkman. Forkman is in the arena right now. And he probably uh, is also watching the uh, Twitch stream. And I think he's checked in. Mm -hmm. no, I, I at checked least him in if a few tasks, then uh, Ernst has a task check in and Vorkman has no tasks. Let's see, they should be both checked in right now, yes. Yep. So the finals is going to be casted by Michel and Dan, I think. I guess. Yeah, I okay. Think... So I can just, I don't have to destroy my voice. <laughs> oh, but that's fun. Oh, but it's okay for us to destroy our voice, I guess. Yeah, that. it's good. You see, Michelle, that's why old boards can never be trusted. Well, like the no. current board can be trusted. <laughs> of course! <laughs> ah, okay, we should be able to uh, do it now. Alrighty then. I guess you need to get in a voice call with, with Fork on that? Um, no. Or you just go, alright. Because no. he's streaming this to us. Uh, we, he needs to be here so people can hear our voice on stream. Yeah, fair, fair. Alright. I wonder how this will go. What are your predictions, Michel? I don't know if Ernst muted himself already. But... Well, given that I don't get any reaction from him, um, I think he's muted. Uh, he muted us, so. Yeah. Great. Yay. What do I think? Uh, I think he's going to have a difficult time. He wanted to take it slower, but I don't think Falco's going to allow okay, it. Okay, it's, it's fucking something up, and I believe... Oh? Mm. Hold up, let me join. Is Nude uh, available? Uh... Oh, I see what's going on. I think you maybe you entered something for... Uh, for yeah, it, it, select, it was in the wrong uh, thing, but I... I believe I can just do this. Reset match. Hmm. Yes, very peculiar. Indeed. Ah, things are happening. Okay, we should be there good now. Alright, cool. Things are ready then. Yes, okay, now it's good. Go on mute again. Alright, sounds good. Okay, the command is deleted, I think. <laughs> what does that command do? Uh, I, I can't. There was a command made uh, uh, during the streaming week, um, yeah. which was, I think, a shot or drink or Akam, which just says that Akam has to take a shot because people liked it that I did that for some reason. Alrighty, Actually, why? Then. That's why I should oh, have it's, an it's, item it's, from uh, my chest. It's, it's a prize. Uh, so they were like, every time there is a prize, uh, you have to do a shot. Akam takes another shot now. <laughs> <laughs> and that's right. why you steal items in Minecraft. But let's still go to game one. Because the uh, first is Falco. On mm. small battlefield. Honestly, I don't think any card, any of these cards has a big advantage on this, this stage. But on I... stage, no. But I do think Falco has an advantage here because you can just get in and do its thing. And keep juggling. Yeah, that's one of the uh, worst things about Kazuya is just this awful disadvantage. He just doesn't really have a good way to get out of it. Especially if it's a juggle combo. Which which unfortunately for him is Falco's specialty. 
Yeah, just like not being able to kill in the air. Yeah. But, that's uh, a bit unfortunate. Oh, that's... He shouldn't have used the side B. That's unfortunate indeed. Of course, Next if Kassia B. uses his side B, he doesn't get another up B. Yeah. Let's see. How will this match go? It's just so difficult for him to get in. And yeah. it's so easy for Vorkman to, 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 well, to get in, yeah. That's actually just the whole match. It's just yeah. going to be us saying, yeah, uh, Falco just got in. Oh! Oh! Uh-oh, what's going on? Maybe? He got a side yeah. special. Come on, my, come on, my man, Aaron. Don't start mashing things. Think! Use your brain! Play the slow game like you want it. See, yeah. that's, that's a good one. Just react and punish. Because you can't uh, challenge him in the neutral if, if you try to approach him yourself. But it seems like, uh, well, Pokemon also has, has to say, like, what? Um, SD compilation, anyone? Oh, wait, he was just getting on stage. That's uh, what he was doing. Yeah, yes. exactly. It's a just more efficient way of getting on stage. That must be it. Of course, how could we not have seen that? Although he was on stage to begin with. Exactly. But now we're quite close again, and I think uh, this will be Ernst going back into disadvantage. That would have been a very unfortunate air dodge for anyone that wasn't uh, preferring the air. But maybe... Oh. Oh, he tried to go for the spike, but of course Falco's jump is very high. Exactly. Highest jump in the game, you just really can't spike in that low. It's quite difficult to edge guard Falco because he just has so many options because of his second... because of his double jump. Because you, you basically have to read it because it's so fast. Oh, that's not going to kill, but it's going to do a decent amount of damage. Yeah. But I, I think if uh, Bobby Bokken can get off a decent combo, he can probably finish the game. But uh, I could sort of say the same for Vorkman. Just hit your electric lol. <laughs> or do just, that. Just do electric, yeah. Oh? That's oh, also advice to Falco. <laughs> Use an electric, like the laser. And a down... Oh, not game yet. But it's getting quite... Cool. Ooh. A back air from Falco would also kill Kazuya, I think, right now. It's all, I think it's definitely a down tilt not, not quite yet. Oh, this will this will be incredibly difficult for both of them. But I think in this type of thing, I would give Falco the side. Oh. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> go with this curse. Let's go. And Make takes the first game. Make a compilation every time Dan tries to say something. It just fucking happens already before he says it. <laughs> God damn it. Right. Can you answer that correctly predict something? Yeah. The first game goes to Kazuya and barely. I think if Vorkman didn't SD the second stock, it would be an entirely different story. Oh, definitely. Definitely. He would have just probably won the game. Most likely, yeah. But fortunately for... Of, well, fortunately for Bobby Bokking, but unfortunately for Wortman, it did happen. And now I wonder a bit to see if the next game will go different, but it seems like they will it's be going back going to, to Small Battlefield. Game. Yeah, it's Small Battlefield again. It's, yeah, it is one of the most neutral stages there is. The other option would be Pokemon Stadium 2. It is oh. Pokemon Stadium 2. Alrighty then. I thought it was going to be Small Battlefield again, I didn't... Uh, Pretty much attention. All right, and and unfortunately misses that combo. Uh, they both have lasers, though. That's pretty dangerous. Yeah, but uh, Falco's laser is quite more neutral based because it can actually spam it a bit better. Oh! What the hell was that? <laughs> oh, he still made it back. That was close, though. It quite. I think it was like five percent higher. It would have killed him. Yeah. And now it's just a bit of juggling. Ooh, and a back, back air. air. Oh, nice back man, air. man, man. It is a great back air. But now we've gone back to the neutral, on which how I get to give Falco a bigger advantage here. Yep. 
simply because of his aerial approaches. The best way to get the best way for well, as we have to challenge that is with an electric because of the invincibility. But even that, that's not an easy feat. Not only that, Kazuya just struggles with things that approach him from slightly above. It's not well, a bad in min, but still. But well, well, that doesn't ever my well, does my forward there for Bowser never work? Because it's a big body character, Falco's pretty thin. And yeah, kidding, right. Kazuya. Exactly. Yeah, fair. It's got, maybe it's the power of Zephyr, the power of the burp. Yeah, definitely. Uh, the burp has got to win this, right? Exactly. Maybe we do, for next tournament we have to modify the Zephyr bird into like Falco with like the eye thing and stuff. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Then yeah, I want to see you draw that, of course. The board has uh, to draw the bird. Oh, alright, alright. Oh, all right. he's got a fort smash in. Of That's course. Right. Nice. And he has rage. I think if he lands this command grab, it will take the stock from uh, Forkman. Yeah, but, but then he can't use it uh, again. I think yeah. I want to wait for it. Oh, ah. no, he doesn't. And now he has to curse. And now he has to play, <laughs> and there goes the stock. Right in a place where you don't want to be hit. Unfortunate. But now it's 1-1. One, one. And we need to play at least... Still, well... We need to play at least two. At least two, yeah. The best of five. Of course. Eight and more games. Uh, eight more games <laughs> if, if it goes very wrong. <laughs> if we get a bracket reset, we get eight more games, indeed. Uh, this, is, this is going quite even at the moment. But I would give the advantage to Vorkman. Because... Well, I don't know. Something just doesn't work with Kazuya in the Falco matchup. That thing is speed. 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 Well, where were no, they that's now? speed. That's something very different. Smashville or is it Town City? Smashville. Town City is uh, more red. All right then. Three, two, well, one, let's see. Go! I have no idea who wins this stage. I think this is a pretty even stage. There isn't a tri platform, but of course the third platform could help either character. Falco with getting higher and Kazuya with early kills. Yeah, probably. I think Moby uh, will probably have Kazuya more with early combos for high more damage. Oh no, wait, wait. This stage is in the favor of uh, Brock. Because there's a, a kid in the background with BB. He has a supporter. <laughs> On stage. Oh man. Well, it has but been But wait, there are also two owls. Are they bird supporters maybe? No, I don't know. Our... I don't know what kind of bird Falco actually is. I guess Falcon, but... I also heard some people call him a pheasant. So... A space bird. A space bird that didn't kill Kazuya. No. And, oh, that was uh, kind of... And there goes the rage. Let's see if Kazuya can make it back, but I have my doubts. Now he can make it back. This recovery is actually pretty good. Yeah, but Falco's edge guarding game is also quite good. Yeah, if he just used it. And, and that of course, healed. up me out of shield. It a move just, he didn't really need. It, it just works. And now he's just throwing out oh, the and, he rolls and rolling into, the forward into smash. a forward smash. This is just sad. He, just, he did the same with you. He just kept rolling into forward smashes. Um, I have to say yes, but at the same time I don't want to say yes because I don't want to admit my own mistakes. <laughs> why does for why does my forward smash always work that well? Uh, Kazuya doesn't spam forward smash. He just uses his foot to bash you in the head. Oh yeah, that also works. Yeah, fair. And a nice snipe from Kazuya. And well, Fako is quite. Is actually running this quite well, and he's just given up that crazy stuff. But all right, and it's, it's impossible to keep track of this man. I think he shouldn't give up on edge guarding. It's pretty doable if you just, you know, try to stage spike him or something. Yeah, but I think he it's more reliable than that uh, up air. Although the up match is pretty good. Exactly. Yeah, but does more a read, an arrow read, than actually well, edge guarding. I would call. Yeah, definitely. But at the moment, 
Brock is indeed disadvantaged, and he's taking quite a lot of damage from those Falco combos. But what a skill! And he's just going to throw him off the cliff. But it doesn't work. Unfortunately, Falco's recovery is too good to have that work. Oh! 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 He saved him! I think he will be dead. Yeah. To try and kill him and fail at it. Oh! It is still possible to. Good. It's still it's still possible to win for Kazuya. Oh, it's not over yet. Although I give Falco still an advantage. Yeah, but I wouldn't. Oh God! And he won. <laughs> Maybe you should have a cop cast. <laughs> um. What? <laughs> Maybe I should. Uh, Maybe I'm not going to curse Ernst. God damn. And if you're watching this post, um, Dan cursed you. I cursed everybody. Oh, that's why I didn't win. Yeah, uh, even myself. Um, it's just when I say, oh, it won't happen. I wouldn't say it's a match to side. And then it dies immediately before I can even finish a sentence. Ah, oh. Perfect. I can't be already for playing at the moment. Why are you saying <laughs> I play for keeps? <laughs> I keep playing for keeps. <laughs> Edge, Edge do scare yeah, me, Michelle. Edge just, Edge just do not scare me. You wanna know how hard I get edge guarded every time? Harry? Yes, incredibly hard. Uh, <laughs> let's see. No, but the edges aren't something to be afraid about. Just become the edge. Become the edge. Let's see what I also some stupid stuff you can say here. <laughs> There's just a lot of weird things. Hear the roar of my full force neutral attack. Yes, mm -hmm. my, my favorite smash. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. last match. Oh. oh, or match point for Falcon. Match point for Falcon, but it doesn't have to be the last match. It can also be that Bobby Bokken takes this one, and then we get another match. And if he takes that one, we get a bracket reset. Yay! <laughs> Which means more of the same matchup. Yeah. Why does it throw to turn? Oh! <laughs> nice one. Oh my god. And that but is that... why I don't recover too much. That's why I don't like to play against Kazuya. Oh, I don't mind. You just stick around and do an up air. But, yeah, do an up air, yeah. Because you, your character stays at the ledge when you do an up air. Mine goes, uh, mine goes nowhere. That sounds more like a you problem. Just like it... Falco just had the problem of not being able to hit the jab. Unfortunate. But because he now does have that rage, which means uh, big oh! damage. He didn't go for the suicide, but fourth uh, monitor is at 69%. Nice. And not anymore. He lost his power boost. Uh, and he's actually kind of losing right now. He, yeah. I don't know what happened, but Bobby Brocking is actually killing it right now. Yeah, he's doing quite good. Of course, he had a really early spike and the up out of shield really helps. Is he going to do a nice combo here? Ooh, and that's so dangerous, that down smash from Kazuya, that can so easily break shield. But one should really watch out for that move. But this isn't... I wonder if... I really have to say stuff because I think somebody will die again. <laughs> Did it again. <laughs> you were doubting what would happen, so Kazuya just hit and fell to the ground. A tree, a tree stock. Wow, I don't know what happened, but... We get a game 5! That's we get what a happened. We get a game, game 5. five yep. and, if, and if, well, Bobby Walking knows to win, the, knows how to win that game, we will be have a bracket reset. And you know who, what's gonna happen then. Yeah, Rip these casters. No. <laughs> Oh, I'm no. not gonna take a random shot in the middle of Wednesday evening and I have a shot tomorrow at 9 o'clock. I'm not gonna get drunk today. You don't have no. to get drunk. No, true. I, I'm not getting a drink for my shot, but... Thanks, Chad. <laughs> no, <laughs> there's, there's no vote. You're we can make it yourself, up, man. We can make it an official GMM issue if you want to. No, oh. there's already an official GMM issue for me, for you, for you guys. We just oh. need, uh, what, 20 signatures or something? 17? We can get that.
Now it's time for the fifth match of this set. Three, two, one, oh, he thinks go. he's gonna win. Ooh, nice comment grab for the opening. Just an <laughs> nice reflector for the opening. <laughs> I don't think this stage really gives anyone an advantage either. Yes, Falco has a wall jump, I believe. And there are walls on the stage, but they're a bit awkward. They are, uh, matter so little in this stage, and I don't think it will have any effect. Ooh! Ooh. Nice. He just missed it, though. Nice down smash. And Falco also just missed the spike. Oh, well, now it's going to be difficult for Gazir to get back. Because, well, fuck was just it. Why did he do, do back throw? Uh, I don't know. He probably wanted to go for his uh, signature. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> the tennis oh, combo! So bad. You do be styling on him. <laughs> Fun fact you can just hold the A button. Oh, wow. Ooh. It was pretty clear. I heard that if someone can take a shot for such a reason, and then the chairman of the association needs to take it. So, uh, Dan. Oh, <laughs> give me a sec. Why is the vote that I can't take a shot? The yes, yes, and I am boring and choose no. Alright, I have a nice bottle oh, of Tennessee Fire here. And, well. Stopple doesn't work, huh? See. That, yeah, that doesn't work for some reason. That but I will take a shot. But that down beat works like a charm. Oh, we, oh, somebody died? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it did just die. Didn't you pay attention? No, I'm getting myself a shot. Wait, you're. Okay. You're just weak. Yeah, indeed. Nah, for Meanwhile, Kazuya said 190, 199. Ah, and he died. He didn't even lift to 230. Yeah. He's a pretty heavy guy. Dan is weak. He can be easily persuaded to just. Drink alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> it's just alcohol, alright? <laughs> I can't take another shot now. Every time I deny it, it means the Dan is taken, right? Nah. Then all the chairman has to Falco's it. just going to laser all yeah, the time. Is it just both keep lasering and see who wins? <laughs> I think that's the. Uh, depends. I don't really know the ranges for the two lasers. Then again, and the speeds, but of course, Falco can walk in a bit and keep lasering. Ooh. It's going to be quite difficult. Because he has not really doing well right now. Oh, he oh. did it! He did the suicide! I am well, not saying that does anything. Yeah. This is a very no. important stock. Incredibly important. Who takes this stock? It will be either uh, mean that Borgman will be crowned the winner of this tournament or we get a bracket reset. But at the moment it seems quite even. He's trying to get spikes, he's trying to get early kills, but it doesn't seem to work. Belko can of course spare dodge that one. He can't go for the so he can go for the early kill, but I think he should just stick to his safe options at the moment. I don't really know if they work on Falco. Well, maybe. Uh, maybe he's a bit too floaty. Because you saw uh, the combo where he tried the up smash didn't work. Yeah. But oh. now he's got a rage, so this could be it. Real soon yeah. if he can but, manage to hit oh, it. Oh, he already threw it now twice. Three oh. times. Oh. He's, he really needs to look out now, right now. Yeah, he really needs to hit it. Oh, that's oh. that, I think. That's oh, GG. The game goes for it, Forkman. He is the new separate champion. The online champion. The old, ah, still champion. The still the champion of the day. Of the quartal. GG oh, to my man, Forkman. Yeah. yeah. Should we maybe get him in for a winner speech? Yeah. Who knew? Fork beats Rock. <laughs> the new update for rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> yeah. Fork. Lovely. The champion. Alrighty then. Uh... So does that mean that Dorian has to take a shot? <laughs> no, that means that the combat has to take a shot. <laughs>
And that means that means that you had stick should be shell. Um. So what is the price and not the price in the chat? <laughs> what what? Introduce us to the price. Yeah, the price. Damn. Introduce us to the price. Well. Of course, again, as you uh, have known last time, I got shown an Im image at the moment, but as you have known, like, uh, last time we have trophies for stuff like this. And again, the winner will get a nice trophy, which will be engraved with Zephyr, uh, what does it get? Winner of the second internal Smash Ranking Tournament 2021-2022, which you can display and show to all the people, and well, just like a big flex. Mm -hmm. That's bit, that, that's it. Yeah. Really nice. So that's going Forkman's way. Um, maybe uh, we should go in the Discord to a voice channel. He can join or just let him join the channel. <laughs> oh, yeah, he can join this one. Eh? Yeah, he can't join because he's a pleb. I would give him permission. He's not part of the committee. <laughs> <laughs> So we can't say it's fixed now anymore because someone else from the committee won. Even exactly. though there were four people in the fucking tournament from the committee. Uh, no, uh, this isn't a strap trophy. No, every time a separate trophy. So you gotta collect them all. Exactly, it's like, it's like Pokemon. Except more disappointing. If you have all four trophies combined, then you can make Arkham take a shot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Then you have Exodia. <laughs> nice. All right, but maybe we should now go on to the uh, winner interview. Is he on Discord? Is he on the uh, Discord? He is online, but we need to uh, allow him to join. So either he can join a voice channel right now, or we go into a yeah, voice channel that he can join. Let him join a voice channel. Nuri, join one of the what was it? Ten voice channels in Discord <laughs> right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you have a lot of options to choose. I hope you're not. You can make decisions. Don't be afraid. I can advise number seven to you. It's really comfortable. Yeah. Too many uh, people are in number seven. Seven is. Uh, I prefer uh, six. Six is always nice. I prefer if all the previous Smash Masters would be on the trophy. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to design trophies, that's fine. PR? <laughs> oh. <laughs> See? He wants to design trophies for us. Oh yeah, yeah, of course, sounds good. See, but, that's, uh, but that's gonna also require more budget um, board. Can you get more budget, please? Uh... <laughs> um, why do you ask me? Where is Hilda? Where you need her? She, well, she know... There's no Boros right now, so easy Boros budget, right? Yeah, fair. We do have uh, <laughs> residual Boros budget. I don't know, maybe you can sell all of our members. Mm, yeah, yeah. You know what? No, if everybody pays for their sports card on time, for the people that haven't uh, extended it already, then maybe we have budget for this. Your fixed discount. Fixed discount, yeah. Oh. Nuri does not want the interview, I think. I don't see him joining any of the empty voice channels. I don't. In that yeah. case, loser interview, maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah Akam, how are you doing? I am doing great. <laughs> um, my games were. Perfect. I at least um, at least be my opponent had to drop a sweat to beat me. All right, all right. Um, it wasn't a uh, like last time where it just got a bo how do you call it? dominated by my opponents, but this time it actually was a last stop intense situation. It was, yeah, indeed. So right, that's dude. the decision interview, <laughs> right? That's how it works. Exactly, yeah. Of course, that's how it works. All right, then. It seems like our boy Vorkman wants to do the interview. Uh, He's going to go to Voy. <laughs> that's two. <laughs> okay, let me... Like uh, that. All right, then. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> also work. Welcome um, to the Castas. Yeah. yeah. Don't yeah. be scared. We don't buy them. <laughs> Not yet. But uh, one, aka Nuri, can you please tell us about your uh, victory? Yeah. I think I'm just better online. Like with the previous tournament, I came third, but I think I'm 
I don't know, I played a lot of LAN, so I think I'm good better in that, that spectrum, I guess. Mm. <laughs> because I'm a little bit surprised that I came first, actually. Yeah, you jumped up, I think, two spots up the rankings? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, the, the, the Falco felt really oppressive in the, the online meta, yeah, it's nice. Mm. I was uh, with especially with the uh, the side rolling and everything. I was kind of confused at what my best options were because nothing of, of my moves could beat your forward there. <laughs> Such they a strong tried tool. That one move, I don't know what it's called. That they can like crunch the uppercut. Mm -hmm. And see, and when I saw you stand that I was like, okay, now I have to do something different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That thing is the one that catches. My No, but yeah. really well played. A lot of PS2. I thought uh, <laughs> you're, you're one of the few people who like Lilith, right? Or yeah, it's very good mind. for Falcon. Yeah, so that was I one noticed, of my yes. instant bans. Yes. <laughs> oh, you played on Lilith. I played with him on Lilith, yeah, and I regret yeah. my decision since that moment. <laughs> I was like, oh damn, Lilith open? Right. Mm. <laughs> I didn't know I didn't know Lilith was that good for Falco, so I was like... <laughs> But so leave it open. Whoever picks Lilith, nobody in association likes it at the stage. Apparently, this guy does. <laughs> yeah, I know it's in the last tournament. Not very nice. Wait, you bent it for you bent Lilith for me, I think. Yeah, because because it's funny with you. Yeah, because <laughs> I actually pick it too. Sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, you did not expect it uh, to get first. No, I thought maybe I became second, but first no. Mm -hmm. oh, well, oh, this is a nice surprise, of course. Yeah, sure is. And you're gonna get a trophy out of it. Woo! Yeah, we will get. Uh, I get it? We will um, ask TM. some uh, address stuff and uh, everything off stream, and then we'll send it to. Ah. You. All right. Bye. Nice, and I think that's uh, it for us as well on the stream. I think so too. Yeah. Of course, the follow-up now is uh, for us to look at some uh, highlights and uh, you will see that clip and the uh, entire vault on the YouTube channel and everything, so yeah, look out for that. It's going to take a while though, because there's a lo long backlog right now with the streaming week. Oh yeah, yeah. And exams and everything. The PR committee will be very busy, or I think a couple will be very busy. I am mostly me. Yeah, thank you for <laughs> all the, the co-casters for doing an amazing job. Always happy to uh, help, well. Because I died for early in tournament, at least I could cast a lot, which is always nice. Very, very good. And of course, stay tuned for uh, future tournaments. Exactly. Yeah. Well, yeah, every card hmm? Yes, uh, every card, but hopefully back offline. Yeah. And we'll probably also start organizing soon some preparations for the larger external tournament. But when will that will happen? Will be disclosed later. Yes. Mm. We'll keep you updated. Oh. But that means uh, we're out. So thank you all for watching, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Yes. Bye. Yes. Goodbye. Bye bye. Yeah.